area school is in the middle of a religious based controversy and a lawsuit tonight. Well, the Rankin County School District and Northwest Rankin principal have been named in the federal suit. Joe Barnes is live at district headquarters in Brandon with details. Joe. Howard Maggie, the student that filed this lawsuit, says that she was forced to go to an assembly not knowing what it was about. In court documents, she described it as a sermon. However, school leaders have a different take on the situation. Northwest Rankin High School is where the American Humanist Association says a religious assembly was held for students earlier this month. A junior at the school identified only as MB is listed as a plaintiff in the suit. If the school sponsors the event, uh, it's, and it's, a, it's a school event, then any speech that it sponsors is state speech, not private speech. The suit claims students were not told what the assembly, which was about hope with religious messages, was about, nor were they allowed to leave. Rankin County schools say four or five young men asked to have the assembly, meaning it was student-led. A district spokesperson released this statement. Our students have the freedom to organize student-led and planned meetings, and the assembly in question was student-led and organized. The meetings were not mandatory. The AHA claims the assembly and the school's consent to have it during school hours is a violation of the Establishment Clause in the First Amendment of the United States Constitution. The Supreme Court has already made clear uh, speech at school events, even out of the mouth of a student, if it's, if it's sponsored, organized, and approved by the school, is effectively school speech, and school speech promoting religion is unconstitutional. Now, we did receive emails from people claiming to be parents of Northwest Rankin students who they say also attended a similar assembly. Now, they also asked not to be identified or interviewed, but did say they were offended. As of this afternoon, the Rankin County School District said it had not been notified of the lawsuit. Reporting live in Brandon, Joe Barnes, WLBT News.